hi guys welcome back to my channel it is miss fashionista here with another video for you guys yes my background is a little different but don't worry about that so today i'm going to be filming filming a video um is this going to be this look that you see here on my face this is more of a like nighttime look um i wouldn't wear this during the day people are probably gonna look at you kind of crazy like where's she going but yes this is more of a nighttime look and i did it all with the bh cosmetic 120 palette um on my eyes and then i also and i also use the um nyx colored mascara as well so you'll see how i use that and where i use that um so yeah if you guys would like to see how i achieve this look go ahead and keep on watching so i'm going to start out with a primer which is the elf poreless primer and I'm going to just apply that all over my face. Not necessarily all over my face, but really focus on my T-zone. And just blend that all in. And then I'm going to start with my eyebrows and I am using the NYX Micro Brow Pencil. And this is my Holy Grail. I freaking love this just to fill in my eyebrows I arched them myself so I just basically just fill them in to define them a little more And just blending it in with the spoolie on the end so that there's no harsh lines there. And then I'm going to go ahead and take my Maybelline Fit Me Dewy and Smooth Foundation. And this is in the color 355 Coconut. So I am going to just apply that to my face with my Real Techniques Stippling Brush. Um, this foundation is awesome. It is when I tell you like it goes on super smooth just like it says and it just sets and it sets so perfectly and flawlessly so um, I love this foundation and then I'm just going to prime my eyes with the LA Girl Pro Concealer. I'm just going to apply that to my eyelids so that I can put my eyeshadow on and it sets. And there I am just applying the tape to my outer edge of my eyes so that I get a perfect sharp line there after I apply my eyeshadow. And the palette that I'm going to be using for my eyes is going to be this BH Cosmetics 120 palette. And I am going to start with this really dark midnight blue color. And I, um, oops, no. I'm not going to start with the midnight blue color. I'm actually going to start with the base. And it's actually a warm beige color. And I'm just going to apply that all over my lid first. And now I'm going to go in with the Midnight Blue color. And I'm just going to apply that all over my lid. And then I just sprayed my brush a little bit after applying some more of that color 
with my setting NYX setting spray just to intensify it a little bit more. And then I'm just going to take my blending brush and just blend it all in so that there's no harsh line up there at the top. And then I am just going to take a matte black shade just to intensify this look a little more to make it a little more smoky. I'm just going to apply that to my outer corner my outer V should I say just applying that on top of the blue and then I'm just going to take my blending brush and blend that in and then I'm going to take like a champagne color and that is what I'm adding to my inner corner. And then that same champagne color I'm going to apply to my brow bone to highlight that. And now I'm going to remove the tape because I am done with the eyeshadow. And now I'm going to use that same HD LA Girl Pro Concealer that I use for my lids. I'm going to use that as a highlight on my face, under my eyes, on my nose, on my forehead, and my chin. And I'm going to take my, um, that same HD Pro Concealer in a darker shade to use for contour. And as you can see, it squirted out a bunch of oil and I was confused. <laughs> Let's contour my nose. And it's still squirting out oil. I'm not sure what's going on with it. And I'm going to use my blending sponge to blend that highlight in. And I'm going to take my NYX Set It Don't Fret It powder to set my concealer so that it does not crease. And I am just taking this blush brush by e.l.f. to apply that. And I'm going to let it set for a minute. And then I'm going to take this small stipple brush and blend in my contour that I added. I'm just going to blend that in. And 
And then for my nose, I'm taking this Real Techniques brush. I am not sure exactly what it's called, but I will definitely leave the name of that brush in the description box. It is perfect to contour my nose, so that is what I use to blend that in. And then I'm going to bronze up my face with this Fergie Golden Goddess Bronzer. And then I'm going to take this concealer brush by e.l.f. and just wipe away that excess powder from setting the concealer. And this brush is actually perfect for that. Um, I just use in small circles to wipe it away. I find that that works more effective for me instead of just brushing it away with a big uh, fluffy brush. And then I'm going to take this contour and blush kit from e.l.f. and I am going to just use that on top of the contour just to define that contour a little more and then i'm taking this um, blush by essence to apply to my cheeks and this is in the color peach i believe if not it will definitely be listed in the description box And the highlighter that I'm using is the Maybelline um, Studio Highlight, and this is in the color Mauve. I am obsessed with highlights, and I am actually obsessed with this one at the moment, so I use this every single time I use makeup. <laughs> it just gives you that perfect glow. So I'm applying that to my cheekbones. And also on the side of my forehead, just give that wet, glowy look. And then I'm gonna apply it to my nose. And now I'm going to go to my lashes. I'm going to apply this Unique Mascara 3D Fiber Lashes. So the first thing that I'm doing is applying the gel and then I apply the 3D fibers which extends the lashes and then you apply the gel again to set it. So I'm going to do that. And as you can see, it made my lashes longer. I just love it. And now I am going to go in on my bottom lash with this colored mascara by NYX. And this is in the color blue. I'm just going to apply that until I get the desired look that I'm going for to that bottom lash. And 
and I just kept applying it because I didn't see really I couldn't really see it the light that I have is kind of a bogus that I'm using so you really can't tell that I have blue mascara on at the bottom but after I did the video everyone was like oh you have blue mascara on your lashes so you could see it apparently but you can't see it all that great in this video but I'm gonna take my NYX liquid suede lipstick and I am going to apply that all over my lips and that is in the color sandstorm I just love this NYX liquid suede lipstick it is so awesome and it's so buttery just great and then I'm going to take this NYX soft matte lip cream um, I can't remember the color that that is in it is like a pink color and I'm just applying that um, to make my lips a little more pouty and right in the middle and there is the finished look so I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and if you did please go ahead and give me a thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.